This playthrough is rated E for everyone. Just the day in the life of an everyday 15-year-old uh, sailor who's been forced to do this because his uh, young friend got stuck in a barrel. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Von Arbeck here with another episode of Grandia. In the last episode, we went on to the steamer and talked to everyone here and learned a lot, a little bit about everyone and what we're doing here. But uh, apparently, Sue uh, followed us and stowed away, and she almost got thrown into the village. But uh, luckily, we were able to convince them not to by forcing us to become sailors. So it's a sailor's life for me, I guess. But so let's see what's going on here. But before that, let me get some extra dialogue for this guy right here. Was it this guy or? Okay, here we go. So he's the one who asked us what uh, learning to be a sailor is about. So let's give him some different answers this time instead of the, the best answers for the jerky. So, gotta learn to swim? Oh. Yeah, that's true. Well, but I don't really know. Oh. This isn't the first time Justin hasn't studied enough, right? You're terrible. That's not so, Sue. Okay, let's uh, put the first part, and then you gotta have chest hair? Hey Justin, isn't that discrimination? How can women obey that rule? Except, uh, isn't the rule of the sea that no women can be of the sea or something like that, at least in this world? But don't you think it's the chest hair that makes a man of the sea? I don't want to look at your chest hair, dude. Okay, and then, I don't really know. Okay, it's the same same response, so. Yep. Uh, then, uh, obviously, choose the top one, so. Uh, take a bath? Don't take a bath? <laughs> Who has to obey that rule? Ugh. Say, Justin, don't tell me you still haven't taken a bath yet. Yeah, gross. It's, if anything, it's the smell. Like, hmm, I guess I don't know. Okay, it's the same thing either way, so. Alright, let's see, and Dunk Dirty to see. We already did that one from before. Okay, this one we get to be jerky. Now, there's one more person I want to talk to because I want to purposely give the wrong answer. Because with that guy, you could have given the wrong answer, you'll eventually get the beef jerky. But there's one lady that um, that you can talk to that, uh, um, that uh, has a one-time thing, and I want to get the humorous response for it first. So let's go um, to the lounge. I'll talk to the other people later because I'm going to reload this save because I, I just wanted to show off the, the humorous dialogue too, so. And uh, let's see. I forgot which lady it was. I think it was like this lady or something like that. Nope, not that one. Oh, okay, here we go. Sorry, it was the wrong, wrong lady. So, alright, so this lady is um, asking, this is the lady earlier said she was ugly or whatever the previous day, and now she's asking us if we have too many. Um, freckles so <clears throat> so to get the item you want from her uh you need to choose not to worry just a couple but uh let's choose the wrong answer so do i have any too many freckles not at all liar be careful justin a young girl's heart is delicate and fragile like glasswork yeah whoops yeah forget it yeah she she doesn't like it when you uh, tell her the wrong answer so all right i'll be back and choose the other option give me a second Okay, let's choose the other option for her. Yeah. Um, actually, you do have a lot. <laughs> you don't have to be so honest. You're terrible. Justin, should I think you're trying to get me into a fight too? Hang on, time out. Just forget that, okay? Okay, well, anyway, let's... Uh, <clears throat> Alright, one more time, and then we'll do the right one. Actually, and then I'll actually talk to people legit, because that's the only one I can think of that has optional dialogue or whatever, so... Actually, technically, there's one thing, but I'll have to... Um, kind of save scum to win that one, but uh, I'll be back in a second. Alright, let's get back to talking to everyone, so let's see, I don't think, I'm trying to remember if there's any extra dialogue with Sue on. Understand, Justin? Okay, okay, I understand. That's the, uh, that's the sign for the, uh, don't run in the hall, so. Almost like a weird creature with like a bow and like a plate. Actually, never mind. I guess they didn't have anything to say about that one. Yeah, we already talked about young class, but 
Yeah, it is kind of weird how some stuff Sue will respond to and other stuff isn't. So sometimes it's hard to relegate whether I need to talk to or check up on. So let's see if anyone's in the cabins. We couldn't do this before, so. Hey, how's it going? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Ouch. And it's uh, it's it's something when a when a parent loses their child. No, no, no problem. Look at that green. What's that? Is that gold? Is that a gold toilet and a gold bat bathtub? Talk about it. extravagant. A little extreme, don't you think, guys? I just see if there's anything else I can do. I'm not a porter. Wait, what? I'm not your son. Huh? You mean me? Oh, wait. Your son looks like a puff puff or whatever? What? So your son was a pet? P P Puffy does? Puff, 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 puff? Okay. Pillarino, huh? Puff, puff, puff. Oh, I guess I'm glad I'm making you feel better, I guess. Hmm, a son who looks like Puffy. Just what could... Yeah, that's a little weird. Oh. Yeah, okay. Puffy is happy to be of help. Puff, puff, puffed. Yeah, there's different dialogue if you, uh, you know, show him Puffy, so. Remember to do this often with these, I think it's these folks specifically, but yeah, you have to talk to them over the course of the journey. Um, couldn't do it on the first day because the doors were locked, but. Um, but yeah, make sure to come back to talk to those people multiple times. You'll get something for it, so. Another person called me a porter. Clean the toilet? Did it clean the bathtub? Yes, ma'am, right away. I just die. I do like things tidy, but dying is a bit much. All right. Okay, okay, the bathtub, right? I'll clean it right now. Yeah. How about you, sir? Are you, are you a clean freak? I mean, I like keeping my place clean, so. Wow, it really is incredible. I wonder how much it costs to stay here. Ooh, really? Cost to ten people, huh? It's... I'm a rich individual, yes. The service must be first rate, too. Yeah. yeah, I wish I could have the money for stuff like that. Oh, well. Actually, I'd probably just... Whoops. I'd probably just hoard the money if I actually had that much money. Probably wouldn't spend it. I'd be like, oh, it's save it for a rainy day type of situation. Anyway, let's clean this thing. Guess I gotta clean it. Ah, what's she mean, filthy? What's clean to me? That's odd. Could you mean the ti that tiny smudge? Huh, just that little smudge. Well, I guess I gotta clean it. Okay, that does it. Is that it? Just, I guess a clean bathtub is best after all. Yeah, I guess so. I guess same thing. You feel better for me clean? Couldn't you clean the smudge? Man, we get 25 gold for helping her for her efforts, I guess. Oh, yeah, I guess I've done my job. I can leave. But, yeah, free free 25 gold for uh, for that. Okay, well, anyway. Okay, let's go uh, back. Let's go into the lounge and see what everyone has to say here. Yeah, jittery last time. <laughs> but, sir, weren't you the one who was all jittery last time? You know, saying, hidey ho Uh-huh. So you really don't remember. You were singing Heidi Ho. You keep saying that, Justin. You're embarrassing me, too. Huh. I think he just got caught and doesn't want to... Just doesn't want to point it out. How strange. I'm sure it was you, sir. That one dancing to Odd Dance? Hmm. Maybe he was a liar. Justin, who are you imitating? So you were listening. This is the pose that Blink Wayne always takes. Who's Blink Wayne? Wayne could swing a sword so fast you couldn't see the tip. He always pushed his hat down. That oh, must be from a book or something like that. Puff, puff. What's wrong, Puff? He hungry or something? Hey, aren't you listening? Of course I was listening. Um, he always pushed his hat down and said puff, puff, right? <laughs> oh, you got half of that right, I guess. What was it fried, fried herring with tartar sauce, southern seagull stew for today? President Adventures. You got engaged, huh? Oh, well, sorry, you, you took too long, lady. I'm so frustrated. She said frustrated and spelled it out. 
There must have been a torrid romance between those two. That's my dream. You really are a romantic, Sue. Yeah, she says E. I am so F R U S T A R T E D. Could the president be Mr. Gauss for Mom's letter? Wow, he's engaged. Okay, extra dial. Let me see. Uh, I think that was from yesterday, though. I'm sorry you feel empty, dude. Even after eating, you still feel empty. Off to the new world for food. Oh man, yeah. that's the same from before. Yeah, chestnuts. Okay, that's the same. I'm Sue, and this is Puffy. Pleased to meet you. Puff, Puff. Yeah, uh, yeah. Sue's her name. Oh, you're strange. You're being creepy, kid. Okay, well, I mean, I mean, Sue. Sue's design is cute. To give to 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 you know to tell the truth, but you know that's it. Cute. That's uh, that's the farthest we'll go with that. Game of chance, huh? Uh, hmm. I'm sorry, I'm a duty. Sounds interesting. So there's a chance. Basically, it's a 50-50 chance you winning actually an extra hundred gold or you losing a hundred gold. So if you don't care about losing a hundred gold, I wouldn't do this because it's only. I think you can only do it the one time. Um, but there's no guarantee that it'll work. So, um, what I might do is I might uh go save it really quick. And uh, sorry, I'm on duty. Yeah. Okay, well, anyway, I'll come back. I'll try to see if I can win it. But I want to save it first before I do that, so. Be so cool, huh? Wish I could be cool. Yeah, I'm not a cool man in real life. I'm pretty nerdy. Hmm. Nothing at all. But I like to meet a great adventurer like, like my, yesterday. Yeah. Uh, photo permission? <laughs> uh, a photo as in... Fo uh, F O T O P E R M I S H U N. Photo permission. Don't know about what that is. You should ask the captain. Yeah. Shoot the streamer, huh? I mean, it looks cool. I would, I would take pictures of it. So dramatic. Is this is one picture enough? Uh, Sue, you're kind of a nar uh, narcissistic, aren't you? Dreams of ranching, huh? Monster rancher, maybe? Sheep ranch? Uh, I guess. I, people need wool, I guess. Okay. Oh! I pressed the wrong button. Now I have to go reload the, the file again. Dang it! I was just pressing the button really quickly just to get to that dialogue, but I pressed the wrong one, so alright, I'll be back in a second. Jeez. Alright, let's see if we can win that 100 gold before we uh, win the, the item from the lady, or get the item from the lady for uh, being nice. All right, let's do it. All right, here we go. Heads or tails? Uh, heads. Oh, I lost. Ah, oh, that's so bad. That might be punishment for not being careful with money. Hmm. Let's see if we can win that, though. Huh, it's heads. Yippee, I won. <laughs> what do I win? Great, Justin. Puff puffed. Yeah, give me that 100 gold, so. Sir, I think you're faking it. You're not smiling. You look pretty annoyed. Yep. So you only get to do it once to get free 100 gold. Now, the thing is, it is random. It's not one of those weird things where if you choose, like, one, it'll be the opposite one. Like, he's messing with you. I had to take... How many tries did it take me off screen to do, get that to work? Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like, ten try, Almost ten tries to get me to, to win. It's not, it's really not worth it, but I thought I'd show it off, so. Okay, let's be careful this time. All right, not to worry, just a couple is the answer we want from this lady. Yes, you're right, thank you. I thought I was fretting about too much. Of course freckles are part of the lure of a lady. Like me, for example, yeah, uh, Sue's got three freckles on her face. I feel better, thanks for your help. Freckles are one of a lady's charms. You can become a lovely lady and have torrid love affairs. You're too young for that, Sue. Oh, we got chocolate, yeah. Yeah, sweets are actually, if you eat too much sweets, you'll actually get, uh, at least when you're younger, it could actually cause you to get more acne and stuff like that. So, um, so it's, sweets are one of those things you get, you eat a little bit of, of after like dinner for like to sate your uh, hunger, that type of, or sate your appetite or whatever. Thank you, I'm rooting for you, miss. So anyway, for being nice to that lady, or saying the right answer, we get ourselves some chocolate. 
So it restores 40 <laughs> HP. Bitter. Actually, I think we've gotten chocolate before, but anyway. All right, I think that's it for the only thing um, that I haven't gotten is talking to that stowaway multiple times and talking to that couple, but that's over the course of the journey. So remember to go back to those people that talked about um, Sue and Puppy and stuff like that, so. Actually, I probably should go save it really quick, actually. Because <laughs> I, it took me, like I said, it took me 10 tries to finally win that 100 gold. Not that I need, not that my whole game strategy is based off winning 100 gold, but I am trying to keep, um, I am trying to keep level grinding, not to the minimum. You know, not going off screen and trying to bust up my, uh, bust up my stats, you know, crazily. Even though the game is easy enough as it is, but still, I'm trying not to do that, so. If I really wanted to, I'd just fight enemies over and over and over again to max out my, you know, whatever stat, just to get them evened out, earn a ton of money, uh, afford all the stuff, but I said not really, not really worth doing, so. At least I don't think so. I mean, you can if you want to, but like I said, this game does not, does not, uh, is not treated as like this really hard RPG journey. It's more about the experience and the adventure and everything like that, so. All right. And I do kind of want to save it just in, ca just in case I can't win the, uh, the, uh, uh, next mini game that's up ahead. Actually, I do want to purposely lose it too, just to see what happens if you lose as well. So maybe I'll cut that in later. <laughs> I thought it was a goner. Huff huffed. Yeah, they can get angry. They need them chocolate or something. Like that. So, quit your yakin. Oh, <laughs> quit your yakin. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, we didn't have to be called. Swabbing the decks, huh? Oh, boy. Okay. Let me talk to everyone else before we uh, start doing the swab the decks thing. So. Rules of the sea. All right, Justin keeps on failing at things, so he needs to pay attention. I know, I know, I just failed a little. I don't want to be thrown overboard in a barrel. Not like some dwarves in a certain movie. Don't spill blood in fights. So this is the guy who tells us the three rules, by the way, for that one guy. Even though all you have to do is choose the top answers, but give her the barrel, huh? You're so right. I am so. Re you are right. so right. I am so relieved. Gosh, I thought I was a goner. Yeah, you gotta work hard now as a sailor. To the bone. Uh, to the bone. Please be gentle. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to be working towards becoming a lookout. Yeah, more fun than swabbing the decks. Yeah, more responsible. Yeah. Well, aren't some icebergs, like, bigger under the water? So you really have to have a good eye to catch that. This weapon is a Titanic, so. Yeah, she became my mom. Yeah, Princess. I don't want to become a full sailor. I got adventuring to do. Swarm brother. No, don't make me repair the crane. Yeah, you handle cranes. I'm not gonna handle cranes. But anyway, let's uh, let's do the sweeping and uh, or swabbing and see how well we do. So let me see if I can earn the reward for doing it. All right, uh, tell me how to do it. The secret of good waxing is a balance of power and speed. To get started, press the X button. Pre then press the X button to raise the power and increase your waxing speed. But if the power goes over the maximum, you'll get tired. So don't be careful not to keep the button down. Relax the, re release the X button to decrease the power. A good rhythm with the button will keep the power near max. The key is to pace yourself. You'll get a nice reward, so don't slack off. So the reward for this competition is to clear it in under like 25 seconds, I believe. I don't remember if it's like 25 something something. But if you can get it around that time, you'll earn a, you'll earn 25 gold pieces for it. If not, you just do it. So. Uh, and if you take too long, it takes uh, 35, um, 35 seconds to lose if you just don't do anything or hardly mess with the button. So I want to show up what the last, last one is, but I want to try to win first. Or I want to try to get the, uh, get the money if I can. So if not, I'll cut to a, uh, uh, a run where I do get it. So. Are you ready? All right, let's do it. I already know. Let's, so let's start. Uh, 
No, that's... Yeah, I'm not getting it. If you mess up too much like that, so... Yeah, Sue only gets a single uh, row, and you have to do all of it yourself, so. I like the, I love the music for this one, by the way. It's like the victory music, something like that. Okay, anyway. So, I did it, but I didn't get the reward. You have to do it in 25 seconds, so I'll have to try it again, so. Yeah, sorry. Oof. Yeah, we'll try <laughs> We'll mess up on our first try. We'll do better next time. Yeah, we could swap some more, but you only have to do it once, so I yeah, forget it, so. All right, let me try. Let me come back and let me see if I can... Um, get it let me see if i can do the win condition next time so all right i'll be back whoo that's pretty hard work do we gotta do this every day all right that's what happens if you get the uh neutral response for you just do it but you don't do it super terribly so all right let me show off the successful one this time guys did a pretty good job for newbies. No problem. Cleaning a job like this. Piece of cake for an adventurer. Justin, so adventurers are good at cleaning? Sure, adventurers are good at anything. Great, you can do it again tomorrow. Here's 25 gold for some pocket money for doing such a good job. Alright. Yeah, you get a little extra cash for, uh, um, uh, no. We already did that, so. We don't, you don't get an extra reward. I don't think you can get the 25 gold if you fail and you have to do it multiple times, so. I like the minigame. There's not much to it, but it's it's fun and different, so. Um, I'm going to double check really quick, see what happens if you really fail, but I don't think there's really anything to it, but I'll, uh, give me a second, I'll double check on that, so. Alright, we're back. Let's talk to the captain. If, actually, I don't think he's here. If the steamer were this small, swabbing the decks would be easy. Swabbing the decks would be easy, but nobody would be able to fit inside. Yeah. Okay. He certainly was handsome. Think he used to be popular? Yeah, the dialogue is the same except for Sue's uh, um, reaction. So. Yeah, I'm surprised there's certain reactions that are extra with Sue's there. So, Look, Sue, they call this uh, chart. It's a map of the ocean. Oh, Justin, you're so mean. I'm too short, so I can't see. Yeah, you need to grow a few inches. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, the captain's not here. Sue, look at this. This is how they communicate with people around the ship. Cool, huh? Puff, puffed, puff, puff. Hey, what are you doing, Puffy? This is used, this is used for work. Don't be fooling around. Uh, both Justin and Puffy always want to fool around with anything they see. Another well, teenagers makes, makes sense, yeah. Yeah, Sue doesn't have anything to say about that. Look, Sue, look here. Speak into here and you can talk to anyone on the ship. Pretty neat system. Puff, 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 puff. Puffy seems to think there's something inside there. Oh, Puffy, there's nothing to eat or play in there at all. Nothing in here at all. Okay. Nothing with the dude. Okay. All right, then. I guess the captain ain't here, so. All right. All right. Uh, after that, you can go back to rest. I don't think there's any new dialogue. Uh, after swapping the decks um, with anyone, so you're gonna go straight to the. Um... Okay, yeah. 
Yeah, there's no new dialogue. The new dialogue changes when the um, day changes after resting, so. All right, let's head back to the cabin and rest. And yeah, this is gonna be like this for a couple of days at least, so. Uh, oh yeah, well, let's see. I want to talk to the stowaway again just to make sure that I... Yeah, we already caught that one, so. I don't know why I talked to that guy again specifically, so. Don't worry, they're not so barbaric as to make you shark food. Now, now they throw you over in a barrel. Oh, wait, we already, I already did that last time. Okay, just making sure I talked to him. It's important for something later on, so. Okay, let's go rest, and on to the next day. I think a lot of the dialogue is similar for days, but... Did you work today? Great, you look tired, though. Gets lots of sleep. Ouch! Ow! My body aches all over. Your muscles are just sore, Sue. You'll get used to it. Yeah, I saw you during the mopping game. You had to get Puffy to help you, so... I'll do more than my share of the work today. Well, he's a teenage boy. You know, a lot of them, they have a lot of energy. Thank you, Justin. And you're the one who wanted to come on this adventure. It seems like Justin's kind of like, you know, you know, uh, keeping you afloat. Okay, I think that's the same. Okay. All right, so after that, um, Okay, let's see. I'll double check with everyone, but I think the dialogue is the same for today, so. Yeah, that's similar. Okay. Yeah, a lot of it's the same. So I'll go talk to the usual suspects and see if they have anything new to say. But uh, for the most part, yeah, that's all the same. We were talking to him, but he didn't have anything. Yeah, we already talked to him, so. Alright. Let me go talk to the stowaway and the. Um, um, see if anything new to say. Nope, okay. I think technically you could skip doing this day again if you wanted to just go straight to it. But, uh. It's best to just do it, uh, do it again, just to uh, just to get the extra stuff. But we pretty much got the got the uh, the one people we wanted to talk to overall. So just making sure I got you guys. Yeah, it's just uh, because like I said, there's a couple of people that are like. Um, Yeah, I think the these are the only people I need to talk to. It's just the 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 um, um, stowaway and the people in cabin B. But we have to talk to them multiple times. So, all right, let me go do the uh, let me do the mini game again, and I'll be uh, um, You, 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 even though we're apprentices, do we have to clean all the time? Give us a more important job. Man, we get another 25 gold for doing that, so. All right. Yeah, so. Yeah, we have to do this. What the? Ooh, look at that. Say, what do they use that huge light for? Signals, huh? Well, oh, that makes sense at night and stuff, or during the day, so. Oh, okay. A guest? In the middle of the ocean? Uh, guess the greatest adventure in New Parm? So we're gonna see the greatest adventure? I thought that was like Java or something like that. An adventurer? Oh, desert island, so, okay. Oh, hmm, treasure. 
treasure hunter, huh? Are you a lock or something like that? You know, lock L O C K E from Final Fantasy Six. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll check it out. Cool, the greatest adventure in New Park? I bet he's like a grizzled old vet, you know, big long beard, you know, huge muscles. Yeah. Sue, what do you think this, that greatest adventure in New Parm is like? Think he might be a giant man with a shaggy beard and bulgy muscles? I, I, for, I actually forgot Ju Justin says that. <laughs> uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, he's got to have about five arms. Mumble, mumble. Oh, she's half asleep. Wonder what I'll learn at the Adventure Society. How to disarm traps, tips for fighting monsters, rats. Can't get to sleep tonight. <laughs> Disarming traps, That's that, this is a D&D. &D. Right, did you really disarm traps? Time to go to sleep. Justin, hey Justin, get up or get chewed out. Hey Justin. Uh, just a little more. Let me count to ten. Don't give me that. Didn't they say not to sleep late because the adventure is coming? Dot to dot exclamation point. <laughs> what are you doing, Sue? Get going or I'll leave you behind. Uh, I was waiting for you. It looks like everyone's up, so... Alright. Oh, I forgot to... Actually, did I miss any extra... I don't think so, but... Let's see. Oh, everyone resets. Okay. Nope, that's the same. Okay. Oh, wait, so... Uh, let me greet our guest. Yes, sir, we're off. Yeah, well, I, maybe... Well, her? Wait, what? Aw, oh, man. Oh well, we we saw a job. I guess we got our our, our enough of uh, beefy adventures. Well, if she's a, an adventurer, maybe she's got long red hair, an eye patch, you know, maybe a couple of daggers on her belt, you know, big a big curved blade, like kind of like a pirate, but not quite. There you go. Super first rate. I wish they called me that sometime. Yeah, I guess we do. Wow, but how do you know that? So skilled. Oh really? How would they? How would they know? I guess they're spirits. So what? What would they? What would we know? So all right. But yeah, there's new. Di now that we have a new uh, person on board, there's new dialogue. I don't know if there's a new dialogue. With everyone, but let's kind of skim through stuff to make sure. Okay, you are doing the same thing. Yep. Okay, that's the same. Yeah, when I haven't played, like the last time I pre-played and tested this game was like years ago, so. Uh, yeah, maybe like this, huh? That guy, what's he doing? That's silly, he looks like a fool. You insolent fool! Hey there, what you doing? Oh, this, this is a greeting of cool sailors and adventurers. What is he, performing a high, it looks like a high five. You gotta learn it to be full-fledged. You don't say, I've got a master it too. Didn't you say he was a loser just a second ago? Yeah, it looks like a high five. No, no, you scoop up your hand like this. Like this? Hmm, cool. Oh, brother, now you look like a fool. Uh, didn't he just call him a fool? Yes! You're, hey, you're pretty good at... <laughs> okay, I mean, we can do high fives anytime. It is called a high five. I thought that was so. Yeah, all right. Giving everyone a high five. Is, is, do people still do that? Wow, that's really great. I'm going to get the high five down cold. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's the same as before, I think. Okay. How about you? Yeah, we already did the rules of the sea, so. Okay, I think that's the same. Yeah, that's the guy with the hair thing. You're done. That's the same. Let's talk to Soway just to make sure. I don't remember every single... I, I usually just talk to him every day anyway just to make sure I've got it ready to go. Like, just in case I miss something, you know. So, okay. You are good. 
But I said, you probably only have to talk to him the first day, and then you talk to him, like, at, before the end of the adventure, but I do that out of, like, a weird habit of just making sure I'm covering my bases. Oh, yeah, I forgot to talk to everyone else, see if they need to do dialogue for the adventure, so. I'll, I'll run back down and just double check real quick, so. Okay, seems like we got all the dialogue from you guys. Okay. Don't have to talk back to them again. Yeah, we already talked to that guy. Yeah, I think that's it for new dialogue, so. You know, I mean, I don't mind them not changing the dialogue every single time. But that's a bit crazy when you think about it, so. Okay, that's the same. Yep, same. Yep. Yeah, it's all the same. So. Yeah, photo, album, all that fun stuff. <laughs> okay, I guess we can go up top then, so. Alright, sorry about that. I said, don't remember every instance. I didn't make, when I made my notes for the game, I didn't actually make notes for stuff like that because it, that stuff isn't, I try to remember humorous dialogue if I can, but I didn't write every single uh, dialogue interaction in my notes for this, so like I said, it could be, let's see, yeah, that's the that guy counting rats. That's the guy who wants to scream about pies and whatnot, so. Yeah, you're all saying the same thing. Okay. Alright, we'll, 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 we'll cut it, so. We will not. We will not. We will stop talking with people on this day, so. Oh, right, right, right. Upstairs. Let's go talk to the uh, uh, new adventure, whatever she is. Maybe she's got some interesting tales of daring do. She could tell Justin, you know, a, a newbie adventurer. You know, I wonder how many years of experience she has under her belt. You know, that'll be, it'll be interesting to see what, uh, what type of. Uh... Yeah, I will say hello. No mopping today, huh? Oh yeah, for whatever reason we can't uh, go back that way, but we can go this way. This is the treasure you brought back. Incredible. You are a first grade adventurer. <laughs> I'm home. You all haven't changed a bit. Yo there! Welcome home, Fina. Boy, I missed you. How you been? <laughs> I'm doing great. And the treasure, as you can see, it's just perfect. Fina! You've outdone yourself again. I'm so happy to see your smiling face. Long time no see, Captain. You look well too. Vina, I thought I'd never see the golden legacy of the legendary pirate Warren with my own two eyes. <laughs> Isn't it great? To tell the truth, I had a bit of trouble. There was one trap after another. Whoever set them sure had a bad attitude. They might catch some bumbling adventurer, but they can't catch me. At the very end, though, I thought I was done for. When I had these giant boulders on my tail, but I quickly found a cave in the side and whoa, jumped whoa. in. Whoa, hang on. Let's not waste a good story. Let's go sit down. You can take your time and tell me about your adventure down below. I'll have the men carry your treasure. Okay, Captain. Can you guys take care of this stuff? Yeah, sure. Catch up with you later. Huh, who are you two? Never seen you before. Um, well, I'm just... Wow, a girl! The greatest adventure in the New World is a girl! That's so cool, and she's pretty too, right, Justin? <laughs> thank you. Captain, will you introduce us? Of course, Fina. Those are... Those are our apprentice sailors, Justin and Sewell here. Hmm. My name's Fina. Pleased to meet you. Say, Justin, let's give her the high-five greeting. Well, she just gave it to someone else, so apparently she thinks it's cool. So now we think it's actually Justin thought it was cool. He thought it was a fool. Now he's cool. That's right. We just practiced it. I'm Justin. Pleased to meet you. That, that, that explosion point. <laughs> Didn't you know that greeting is only when you're full-fledged? Oh. Okay, for now, we shake hands. Let's save the high five for when you're a full-fledged sailor. 
Come on, let's go, Fina. Don't be slacking off, eh, Justin? You two, good luck on your ship work. Well, shall we go, Captain? I may give her a different accent, because that's the general voice I give her female characters, but... Ugh, she treated me like a kid. Why do I feel like she's not that much older than us? Hmm, man, probably nothing. But she's so cool. I'd like to be like her. The greatest adventure in the new world. Was well, pretty cute. She was pretty cute. Uh, Fina is a pretty cute character. And lucky for us, uh, Fina is not a girl boss character, so she's actually likable. Oh, no fun at all. Cleaning again today. Don't give me that. Better than being tossed overboard, no? It's your fault. Huh? What the? It's already clean. It even had the sound effect. Hey, it's all hey, it's already clean. Who cleaned the deck for us? Hey two, it's about time. What the Fina? Well, I guess if you're the greatest adventurer in Parm, I guess you do the you could do stuff like this easily. You'll never be a full fledged sailor if you can't get up on time. Good morning, Justin Sue. Looks like one hot looks like a hot one today. Huh? You remembered our names. I'm shocked. And I'm Beryl. No. A first rate adventurer needs an excellent memory. Or I'd like to say so. I heard you about you from the captain, so I thought I'd talk to you. I thought I'd talk to you while it was you, uh, while swapping the deck, but you took so long to get here. At this rate, you've got a long way to go to be a full fledged sailor. <laughs> Jeez, you're pretty tough. But I'm an adventurer, so that's okay with me. An adventurer? Hang on there. The captain said you're a princess sailor. That's just my disguise. I've got a good cover story. You know, Sue just... No, I'll tell her. The problem was that Justin here was trying to ditch me. D ditch you? Or, d ditch you? Now listen, Fina. Justin here is so terrible. Uh, is she gonna rag on me for the next hour? <laughs> and that's it. Hey, I'm a great adventurer, right? Right? You see how it all was, it was all Justin's fault, right? I can see that you two are really good friends. You two are just too funny. I haven't laughed like this in ages. Say, Fina, tell us something about you. No fair just talking about us. You're right. So what about what would you like to know? I'll just tell us, ask her about anything, so tell us about your adventures. Yeah, it's hard to say. It's just a few, in just a few words. Well, we've got plenty of time before we get to New Farms. So I'll tell you a little each day. That means we'll be swabbing the decks for a while, too. Ugh, apprentice sailors have a rough... <laughs> You'll be okay. I'll help too. It'll be fun if we all do it. Yeah, thank you, Fina. I do like Fina's like just design in general. It's like, you know, uh, energetic, happy, but she can do the job when she needs to. You know, uh, I mean, it's typical anime style, but still. Did she say the same thing? If we, if we could? Yeah. Okay. I was just see if we had uh, if she had different dialogue and put it again. So okay. I will not do that again. Okay, well, anyway. How do I start exploring the new world? So, Justin, you want to be the greatest adventurer in the world? We're going to the Adventure Society in New Parm. Fina, are you a member too? Um, well, of course I'm a member. Great, I'll become a member too. I'll be an even better adventurer. I guess so. I'll go with you on your adventure. That sounds like fun. I don't know why they did back in the early like PS1 era. They did a really good job with like kind of uh, uh, characters like this. You know what I mean? Uh, her like this game, Lunar. You know, Fina. Do you live in New Parm? Where do I live? Oh, I do live near New Parm. I live alone. It's a carefree life. Alone? You're tough, Fina. Don't you get lonely? Both my parents died long ago. I used to live with my big sister, but not anymore. Wow, living alone in the New World, Fina. That's so cool. What the? No one said there'd be cloudy. I don't like that wind. It's only the seagulls. I'm, I'm going to see the captain. Justin, Sue, you ought to return to your quarters. See ya. I may give her Lily's voice, maybe the Irish accent, just to give me something different. So, Like I said, that's my generic female voice. So she's laughing so happily, and suddenly she's so serious. What's wrong? Say, Justin, say, look, Justin, suddenly there's no seagulls at all. You're right. I think something's interesting. I think something interesting is going to happen. Let's go check it out, Sue. 
All right, well, it looks like the clouds have, uh... Wow, cool. Wow. Huff huffed. Oh, we're both soaking wet. You look good dripping wet. Uh, freezing? Puff puff puffed. Do you like it? Don't complain if you catch cold, a cold puffy. Okay. Yeah. Well, she, I mean, she seems like a nice person, so. Oh, sorry. You, uh, don't give me that. Oh, sorry. She, uh. Yeah, we might want to. Uh, sorry, Fina said something like, uh, um, I, I, uh, I'll, I'll re talk to him later. Hey, this isn't the time to be talking about that. Don't the clouds look odd? Oh, yeah. Hmm, that's weird. Oh, a storm? Oh, maybe. Okay, that's the same for some reason. How about when I arrive? Uh, how about when I arrive? What about me? Tell me. Um. <laughs> Sorry, we got lively. Lively, you say. More like pandemonium, I think. Yeah, women are curious. We'll never understand them. Never. No, I'm just kidding. Isn't that, isn't that your imagination? The weather looks fine. Not with that attitude, huh? It is a little bit of strange weather, so. And yeah. They are doing the Elizabeth thing again. The creepiness. There we go. Yeah, I forgot you could actually jump on this thing, so. I don't think there's anything to check out, but you could jump on it, see? down. Let's see what the captain has to say. If he's, if he's there at all. Captain, a gale's come up. Uh, ga captain, a gale's come up and the seas are off. Strange clouds are approaching too. This is terrible. I'll assemble them in. I don't only that. I have a bad premonition. Hmm. Hey, what are you? What about what about your work, you two? Get back to work. This has nothing to do with you. Yeah, well, all right. Fina, what? Uh, just what's happening? Is something wrong? Nothing to worry about. Justin, so we'll go back to your quarters and rest. Okay. Justin, let's go back to our quarters. Looks like some big trouble. Captain, we have to change course by as much as we can. Quickly, assemble the men. But Fina, that bad premonition of yours. Could it be the legendary ghost ship? No, not not that ship again. Cut that out. That's just a superstition. A ghost ship? Tell me about it too. Justin, didn't you hear? I told you to go rest in your quarters. Whoa, she got serious all of a sudden. I guess she's in adventure slash adventure mode now, or adventure mode or whatever. No fair. Can't we say just a little? This is not a child's game of adventure. Be good and do as I say. Mm, I feel like we got that. We talked to someone else about the same situation, huh? Miss Fina! Oh, oh my gosh! Come on deck right away! Exclamation point? Uh, why is there a tone change? Captain, tell, tell the men to make sure they can they act calm. The passengers will panic. Whoa. I do not like the sound of this creepy music. Whoa! whoa what the heck? Captain! He's all freaked out. I can't stand it! If this is really the ghost ship, we're doomed! You look so calm and collected, man. Justin, let's go to our quarters. We can't go now. I can smell it a great adventure. Let's go on deck and see. But what awaits us on deck there? Is it truly the great ghost ship? And what about Fina? She's turned into the ser serious Sam all of a sudden. Will she let us go with the adventure? Can we fight go Can we fight pirates or ghosts or ghost pirates? Which is worse? Find out next time in the next episode of Grandia. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.